Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video today and welcome back to Championship Predictions. Um, obviously the Football League kicks off this weekend. Um, so just in case you don't know, what I thought I'd do this season is do Premier League Predictions, Championship Predictions, League 1 and 2. So all the Football League are involved in this season's videos if you like. Basically, so I do, as I just said, Premier League, Championship, League 1 and 2. Also the FA Cup, League Cup, all that coming to the early stages as well because I'm doing Championship and League 1 and 2. So you will see EFL Cup uh, Round 1 predictions. So, you know, keep your eye out for that. Um, but as I said, Week 1 this weekend. So guys, without further ado, guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching and let's go. So the first game I'll kick off with is the Friday night game. It's Luton Town versus Middlesbrough. Luton Town coming up from League One um, after Nathan Jones did a great job about halfway through I think he left. But um, you know what great job he did at Luton. And I think Luton deserve his right to be in the championship this season. Middlesbrough, we're in a bit of a down um, you know, we're a bit up and down, up and down. Um, getting rid of Tony Pulis, that could be a big decision on Middlesbrough's half. Um, but as far as the result goes, I'm going to go for a 2-1 Middlesbrough win. Um, I just don't think they were going to hit the ground quite that quickly. But don't worry, I do think they will get points in the championship a bit further on. But uh, there will be weekly predictions anyway, so you won't miss when I think they get points. Um, the next one is Barnsley versus Fulham. Fulham coming down from the Premier League, Barnsley coming up from League One. Um, so where do you go with this one? Barnsley... Um, as I've just said, came up from League One. I don't think they deserve to go down when they did, actually. I think they were very unlucky to go down to League One, but got back up. Um, Fulham, on the other hand, as I've said, got better get from the Prem, spent over 100 million uh, when getting in the Prem and still managed to fall. Um, you know, getting rid of some really good players, obviously going down. Got not caught online from Brighton with Fulham. Um, got power front three, so. With this one, I'm going to go for another away win, and I'm going to go for a 2-1 Fulham away win. The next one is Blackburn Rovers versus Charlton Athletic. Charlton, yet another one coming up through the playoffs. Blackburn, on the other hand, you know, sitting in the championship doing nicely. Uh, I want to go back to Charlton for a minute. Um, you know, coming up from League One, Getting rid of Lee Bowyer, then re estating him, then, you know, where's Charlton lying? Um, but, where do I go with this one? Um, I'm going to call this a draw, actually, and I'm going to go for a one all draw for that one. The next one is Brentford versus Birmingham. Now, for you that don't know, Birmingham have got to share their home ground with Coventry City um, after Coventry losing their Rico Arena. They didn't lose it, they've just been basically thrown out, so um, it's still rare, uh, as far as I know anyway. Um, but Birmingham, yeah, again, getting rid of Gary Monk. Um, I don't think that's the right move by Birmingham. I thought Gary Monk, Birmingham might be coming on the way back up. You know, where do Birmingham go? I think a lot of it's happened where they got ready to get go go right there and you know didn't really replace him. Uh obviously I replaced him with Jay Franco Soda and they nearly got relegated. So Brentford on the other hand are a really good championship team. Um I don't wanna basically Go on about this because I've got other fixtures to do, obviously all 12. So with this one, I'm going to stick up for a Brentford win. And I'm going to stick up for a 3-1 Brentford win for that one. The next one is Mill versus Preston North End. Now, 
Millwall, as far as the league table goes, they didn't have a bad, uh, sorry, they did have a bad season. But as far as the FA Cup run goes, they didn't have a bad season in the FA Cup run, all the way to the quarterfinals. So, you know, but Preston, they, you know, Planet at Den, um, where do you go with this one? I'm going to call this one a draw. And I'm going to go for a 2-2 scoreline for that one. The next one is Reading versus Sheffield Wednesday. Um, now, if you watch my championship prediction table, you will have heard my thoughts on Reading, you know, going really down on a dip. Same with Sheffield Wednesday, really. Um, Sheffield Wednesday did have that really good season. Uh, and then they just gone down. Same with Reading. You know, they had that really good season. Now I just look down. and um, I'm going to go for another draw. My fans there's going to be so many draws this week. Um, but I'm going to go for a one all scoreline for that one. The next one is Stoke versus Queen's Park Rangers. Stoke, Nathan Jones, and um, Ryan Shortcross got a horrible tackle in their last friendly. Uh, you know, looking out for quite a long time. So get well soon, uh, Shortcross. Um, QPO on the other hand. I'm going to stick up for a Stoke win, actually, you know, think about it. I'm going to go for a 3-2 Stoke win. The next one is Swansea versus Hull City. Now, Swansea is another one that looks down on the dip, but then goes back up, but then goes back down. You know, Swansea, ever since really getting relegated from the Prem. Um, same with Hull, but I'm going to stick up for a Hull City, uh, sorry, a Swansea win for this one. Uh, I'm going to go for a 1-0 Swansea win. The next one is Wigan versus Cardiff. Wigan, far as I really do think, were lucky to stay up. Uh, Cardiff obviously been relegated from the Prem. Um, you know, they did have their, you know, uh, Rare problems in the Premier League, let's say. Uh, but I think Cardiff will win this one. And I'm going to go with a 2-0 scoreline for that one. The next one is Nottingham Forest versus West Bromwich Albion. Now, yet again, if you did see my championship prediction table, you have heard me say a lot about West Brom. Getting rid of Darren. Was that the right move? I don't think so, but obviously you have to wait and see. Nottingham Forest, on the other hand, are, you know, really is uh, a tough one to call every week. Because, like most teams, they have their ups and downs. But I'm going to call this one a draw, and I'm going to call this one a one all scoreline for that one. My last one for this weekend is Bristol City versus Leagues. Now, Leagues slipped up yet again last season. You know, looking really did look like getting promoted and then losing it. I think there's about 10 games left. And then, obviously, didn't do it through the playoffs. Bristol City are a team that I'm expected to see in the top six come the end of the season. So, I'm going to call this one a draw. And I'm going to call this one a one all scoreline for that one. Um... But, you know, guys, you're on the road. Have a safe journey. Guys, you know what to do. Give us a big fat thumbs up if you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.